Welcome to repairing your chroma. There are only a few tools you need to repair your chroma. A 2.5 millimeter hex driver, a 2 millimeter hex driver, a 1.5 millimeter hex driver, and a 00 Phillips screwdriver. Also, you will use the tweezers included with your chroma kit. The first thing you need to do for all repairs is remove the vent plate in the battery compartment. It's held in place by four 1.5 millimeter hex screws. Remove the screws and the plate will come right out. In this video, we will be replacing one of the motors and LED displays. First, remove the motor connector and LED connector from the main board. Next, remove the motor pod lens by twisting it counterclockwise and it should come right off. Now you can see the LED in the middle of the pod. To remove it, simply push the retaining clips to the side. You can now remove the LED and the cable. To remove the motor, remove the four 2.5mm hex screws. Now the motor and the power lead can be easily removed. To install the new motor, twist the power lead so it will be easier to install. Carefully feed the cable down the pod arm. Line up the motor and securely replace the four screws. Do not over tighten the screws or you may damage the plastic housing. For the LED, slip the power lead down the arm and simply snap it into place. You can now replace the motor pod lens and reconnect the LED and motor power cables. This procedure is the same for all four motor pods. To finish up, secure the vent plate back in the battery compartment and you're done. It's important that anytime you do repairs, you should also recalibrate your chroma. For more videos like this, visit nochroma.com.